this episode's Swedish banana. I don't have the feelings to make an intro, so we won't have an intro this time. We might get an intro some sometime. Okay, so first, who is a Swedish banana? And who a gets Swedish to be banana there? is a, and why? a Swede that did something strange, um, very strange. And it can either be good or it can be bad. It doesn't matter. It's just a Swede that just is a banana. But he's banana. He's banana. Okay. He, he's a banana. It, we use the Swedish bananas as um, the normal Swedes, but in this meaning, it's just somebody is let this banana craze and just have done something that is just like what, why, and why for the taxpayers' money. Yeah, in this case, of um, course, it's kind of easy since it's you. <laughs> yes. So this is. Um, I'm just going to give you the story about this first. Uh, there's a city in Sweden that's called Söderköping. They bought three alpacas to help people get better at looking for jobs and getting into the work environment. That mm-hmm. might sound strange. Um, so his name is Jürgen Rosin. He's like the head of the work-making unit in Söderköping. And it was his idea to get three alpacas um, so um, workless people could spend time with them and get better at finding work. Um, so he he got the idea when he heard about a research that talked about the interaction between humans and horses and how it could be a good way to strengthen people who mostly sit at home and have difficulty entering the labor market. But Jürgen doesn't want to invest all the, uh, the money into horses because horses are freaking expensive. So he instead shows alpacas that are cheaper. So once again, the cheapness prevails. Um, Could they just it, have gotten goats or something? No, alpacas, be cheaper. alpacas is best. So uh, <laughs> the initiative is a part of the label of a labor, labor market project that receives financial support from the European Social Fund. So... This insane idea, even I don't care if it works or not. This is one Swedish banana, Jürgen Rosin. He gets this, uh, I don't have a trophy to give, give him, but Jürgen Rosin, you are this episode Swedish banana because that was, that was an idea. I wouldn't say it was good, I wouldn't say it was bad, but that was one crazy idea that just like, we will buy three up alpacas to help people get better get better like um, close to the work market. I, I can't even find a connection. I, I, it's just like, yeah, we, we buy three alpacas to bet, get people into the work market for some reason. Yeah, I mean, there might be some sort of point to it, you know, down the line, but it's not as easy as just purchase purchasing a bunch of animals. There's probably more to it. You need to have some sort of, you know, framework. You have to create some sort of program, you know, for these people to... You have to have a goal. What's the goal with these alpacas? I mean, say that you construct some sort of almost therapeutic-like program around this to get people, like, maybe they're... Like you said, they, they just sit at home and do nothing, and you want to activate these sort of people. Then you need a program to do this you don't just buy a couple of animals and then you're he all set. might have a program i just read the article he might have a program he might have got an idea he also said in the article that this is also like um a new attraction for Söder shopping uh this tree- bull crap <laughs> maybe he was drunk and just bought alpacas yeah and just like oh god damn it how i'm gonna write this off um yes so um to celebrate uh, this very uh, honorable um, prize. He can choose anything, one thing from our um, shop of no, merch. No, no. <laughs> what? Okay, you'll pay for it. <laughs> yes, I will pay for it because you paid for the other stuff. So I will pay for one thing. On, w- w- wait, what, what are our most expensive thing on our shop? Uh, prob- probably some sort of premium hoodie. Okay, you get 400 crowns top. <laughs> that's, that's, that's the roof. Because I don't know if y'all had put on some kind of shiny vase, vase something super expensive or some kind of golden hoodie made by 
Alp. No, you know, no, it's all it's all moderately cheap crap in our great. store. So do, you, don't you worry. You can choose moderately cheap crap from our store. Uh, yes, so that was just a new thing I'm trying. I'm trying to find insane, um, just yeah, news so, so articles. Can, can we expect you to raise the bar with each each candidate? That depends on Sweden. Each nominee. This is a message to Swedes. If you want to be nominated or just win it, yes, please do something that happens in the news and in, in my RSS feed, uh, because that's where I will find the news. Just right now, uh, this one was on SVT, the Swedish state television news outlet. So uh, you have to be on that because I don't check other news as much. So try to be on that and I will see what I can do. This was a message to the Society of Sweden. <laughs> oh, God. If you want to get mo- moderately cheap crap, <laughs> do crazy shit and be a Swede. <laughs> exactly. It will come to you. Or might come to you. It might depends come. on what you do, of course. Yeah. No, so I'm just thinking. Like, I, I just want to. I'm. I'm gonna keep like, just scouring and looking over the news between episodes and just trying to find. And even if something crazy happens, I'm trying to find the person responsible for the craziness, and they are the ones. Situations can't get um, this. There, there needs to be a person responsible for the craziness. Yes, so we are clear. And an and an insider tip. If you want to raise your chances of <laughs> getting nominated, <laughs> waste tax money because there's nothing that angers Simon more than <laughs> people yes. wasting tax money. Waste tax money because, okay, as long as you don't do it in Borås, because I live in Borås and that's my tax money, you can waste tax money better in other parts of Sweden. Just stay out of Borås. <laughs> that sounded horrible. <laughs> Let's build a wall. Keep the Söders chirping and those alpacas away. Yep. Yes. Okay, so speaking of building things, thanks for that, by the way. Okay, you're welcome. Yeah. <laughs> you gave me the per- perfect segue. Woo! Um, Finally. I've, I've got a new building project planned. Oh, nice. That I'm going to start planning. I, I think I'm even going to actually learn SketchUp properly this time and sketch it out before I start. Instead of just doing it. Um, my last project was a shelf that I did like two years ago. Oh, yeah. Um, that I made for... I had this little plastic... Like four plastic boxes. So I made like a shelf for each. Uh, and then I had like hooks underneath where I could hang gu- guitar input cables and such. So basically I shelf my guitar gear. Yeah. Um, and this time I'm going to build myself a wall-mounted entryway uh, table thing with drawers because I've been scouring the internet, all the furniture stores and everything, and I can't find anything that have the dimensions that I would like. Oh. Uh, because I don't know if you remember my hallway, how it looks, or entryway. Yeah. But it's it's not that wide. You know, Maybe no. it's like one and a half meters yeah, tops I would say one or and something. So, and I have this little wall in between the door to my to my bathroom and the door to my, my walk-in closet. And in this little wall area, that's one meter and 20 centimeter wide or something maybe, there I want a sort of entryway table. Mm. But every everywhere I've looked, they're either too too small or too wide or too deep and no- nothing really fits i found one thing that had decent dimensions that could work so i ordered it for 600 crowns got it home mm. and it was the worst freaking crap that i've ever assembled ever nothing fit where it should and i just got angry and threw threw it out what that's that sounds like very non-swedish where did you buy it from ukraine no, I bought it from Amazon. And oh, it, that's why. It, it was Chinese made, so it was oh, yeah. crap. But I, Sorry for it looked good in the Ukraine. picture. But the, yeah. fin- the you know, finish was awful, construction quality was shit, so I just 